Welcome to the Workstudy Plus training tutorial. Today we're going to cover the basics of how to transfer data from your device using iTunes. If you have an Android based device or um, you don't want to use iTunes, you can use email or you can use a sync program such as um, uh, Dropbox or Google Drive. Those will be covered in um, different videos, but today we're going to start out by, first off, you need to connect your device with the USB cable to your PC and open iTunes. As we can see on the screen here, we have iTunes. So what we need to do is at the top, there's a small icon for your device. In this case, I'm using an iPad mini, but it doesn't really matter which device it is. When you select it, it'll give you some details on the device. What we're looking for specifically is the file sharing option on the left-hand side. So select that. It'll give you any apps that have files that you can um, transfer to and from. In this case, we want work study. And once we select work study, it'll give us a list of all the files that are saved into the work study software. And if we go down here, it should, if I've got it right here, um, be alphabetical. So we can see here that we've got one example I'm going to use today is the example manufacturing.wsx file. So this file has a few data um, collection that I did today. And we're going to now um, go to the very bottom. Once you made a selection here, you need to scroll all the way in the outside box and you will see there's a save to a NAD file. So we'll, in this case, because we're taking the data from the software on the iPad mini, to the PC for import, we hit save to. I have created a subfolder um, for data files. I'm going to just select that folder and then we'll hit done. And now we're gonna go over to Excel and under the work study six menu, we will choose the first option, import study data. Now, if it doesn't show up by default, if you're doing this for the first time, which, which a lot of people will be, um, you don't see it here. Now it's in a subfolder in your desktop. So I need to hit the add other button and I need to go into that. Now I've done this before. So I, I already went into my data files folder on my desktop and I select the study and I hit open. And then it's going to show up here. So we'll make sure that's selected and we're going to hit next. We do not need to change in the default options. So we'll hit finish. it will import and everything shows up. Now, very important note, if you do this and the element names are blank and the times are not showing up, that means that you do not have the proper license in the license key screen. I mean, to contact your QTech representative and get the proper license key, enter that under license and then do the import again and everything will work fine. So this concludes the overview of importing data from your device. We will have other videos that cover how to um, export the um, data from Excel to the, to the iPad or Android device. So if you need additional help with the software, please um, contact us at qtech.com or um, send an email to your QTech representative.